can't let fear dictate our lives. And if we let fear paralyze us, then that means there are many unreached people who will never know the gospel. And this is a specific purpose that each and every one of us has every single day, that we go out and we tell people about the goodness of God. People will buy the lie, but they reject the truth that's for free. Maybe it's because nobody's presented the truth to them. There are people in our city. They need that discipleship. And we have the power inside of us to do so. But it's a matter of do we step into that authority. It's going to be scary sometimes. It's going to be times where you feel as though I'm walking by myself. My life may be in shambles. I'm a wreck right now. But do we remember the joy of what Jesus Christ has done in our lives? I hope and I pray that when we walk out of this building today, that we don't let apathy take over our lives, but we go ready to make a change in our nation, to make a change in our communities, to go out and speak authority over the things that God has given us and power to help those who are in need.